Alright, hey, what up, YouTube? Dark Blows here, and today I'm going to be showing you this grill. Um, I got this at the salvage yard the other day for my uh, red truck, which you're going to see sometime. It means I've already um, stripped it down pretty much. I uh, took out the bumper lights, the reflector and turn signal, and the uh, Chevy emblem. All I got left to do is uh, take off this bomb vans. So I'm gonna show you guys how to do that real quick. So first thing is pick up the grill, take it up here, and it's got all these Christmas tree connectors in it. And then this thing, and I don't know if that's stuck or not, but it's got all these Christmas tree connectors. What you're gonna want to do is just get like a flathead screwdriver or something, pop those out with, and um, yeah. Just be very careful because those are kind of a pain in the ass to take off and if you break them, you break them, you're kind of fucked. I'm going to put my vein ones off of my truck on, so that's why I'm taking this one off. So when I paint this uh, beautiful grill. Um, yeah, uh, I also got some other parts, I got some rams and stuff. I'll show you those to you some point in time. Um, there's a little bit of cracking going on. I'm probably just going to get some super glue and fix that before I paint this uh, truck. But, uh, yeah, these grills are pretty easy to come off. I'll show you how to do that when I get the uh, red truck here and I take that one off. So, uh, yeah, this has been another Dark Devil House production. And as always, peace out. Alright, hey YouTube, this is Dark Blue Blows here, and um, I got that bottom valence off. Um, what I used was uh, my handy dandy utility knife there. And I just went up on the, uh, like, the clip was right here, I just went up like this. Just wiggled it around and popped it off. And then for that brown clip, I, uh, because that was the only brown clip, I just went up, held on to the valence, held on to the grill, and pulled them apart. I just fell down, so, um, now what I'm going to be doing is uh, clean up this grill and um, it's going to be getting painted black. I got the emblem. That's going to be red. And um, yeah, it'll look a lot better when this is painted. Um, uh, I need to get some super glue or something to fix this part right here. See look at that. There and there. I don't know if I can fix that or no. I don't really know. But, uh, yeah. So, uh, yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Um, don't worry, I'll be posting the updates about this grill. And, um, thanks for watching. This has been another Dark Purple Lotus production. And as always, peace out. Alright, YouTube, this is my Chevy M1 that came off of that grill. I just got all wet down and stuff. It's already looking a lot better. But I'm um, tell the Chevy on them. Anyways, it's got this uh, chrome shit and it's like all turn up. So I'm gonna show you how to uh, fix that. Um, just get your utility knife and um, over here. Just get it and just. Uh, you know, just kind of scrape underneath it. And, uh, as you can tell, this chrome shit just comes right off. So, don't be worried about fucking it up. It's already fucked up, so. But yeah, that's how you'd get that shit off your chrome emblem. With all that. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. This has been another Dark Pillows production. And as always, peace out. Hey, YouTube. What's up, guys? So I uh, just sprayed the uh, Chevy on one. Um, that's what's looking like so far. Um, to do this, I just got a garbage bag on um, these cinder blocks here. And so I didn't get no horse spray on the trailer. I just stuck that down in there. You can about tell where it was. And, um, yeah, and I still have not started on my grill. Which that's going to be black. Um, but the, the Chevy M1 going to look good. And granted, you can have like the little bumps and shit on it. You know. 
but it looks a hell of a lot better than it did. And this is just the first coat, so I'm gonna give this one a chance to dry. Hit the uh, back side that needs to be hit, and um, yeah, then we'll go from there and uh, see how this thing turns out. What up, YouTube? This is Dark Divorce here, and um, just got this grill sprayed. And as you can tell, it's already looking a lot different. Um, it looks like the SS grill. But, uh, yeah, it looks bomb as fuck. It looks fresh as fuck. Pink and clear over to here, so uh, you're in the shade. You don't want to be in direct sunlight. That's my mom's car. Pretty dope car. Jeep. Um, and then uh, here we got the uh, emblem. So, uh, yeah, it's kind of drying. And this is going to look mostly like the SS grill. Um, but, uh, yeah, it's, it's looking pretty fresh. So, uh, put some more coats on. Right to three. And then, um, two. The three coats of the, uh, glossifier. The gloss. Clear coat. So it has always has that shiny look. Because once it gets super dry, it's not going to look like that. And every little scratch is going to fuck it up. And uh, we don't want that, but um, you can tell, to cover this, I kind of just used these uh, boxes here, and that uh, cinder block for uh, overspray, and I got some right there, and I probably got some underneath, and I don't want to get some right here, but uh, oh well, that grill is looking bomb as fuck. So yeah, uh, peace out everyone, this has been there, that's the Wars production. What up YouTube? So you don't see a Chevy grill, the Chevy emblem over here anymore. It's uh, sitting in the grill now. So here's what it looks like. I got the clear coat sprayed. And uh, yeah, it looks a lot better I think. You know, my red valence is going to be on it. And uh, yeah, it looks a hell of a lot different now. It looks a lot cooler. My uh, bumper lights, I'll show you those real quick. My uh, lights I got for this. Uh, let's try maybe I'm just sticking in there. Again, I hear what it looks like. Here's the lights with the light, put the lights in. Those are red and I thought they kind of looked cool with the red. So uh, yeah, that's what this is looking like. Then it's going to have the red valence on the bottom. And uh, on the top, it looks pretty sweet I think. So uh, hey guys, thanks for watching this upload. Um, this uh, redoing a grill series. and. Uh, Anyways, everyone, I hope you have a nice day, and as always, peace out.